Hello YouTube, this is John. In this video, I'm going to quickly show you how to resolve this issue whereby you try to open your applications but they have been corrupt by a virus called syswin. So in this video, I'm going to quickly show you basing on the previous video I made. I made the same video that had on how to fix this. I'm going to be using the same title with the previous video and this is how you solve it. I had very many questions in the previous video. Uh, very many people were asking me they are not seeing the syswin. So here what we are going to do, we are going to click on this PC and then to bring you here. Then the first thing you will see up here you're going to go and click on view then when you click on view you go and check this part where there is options and these are some of the folder options then again you go to view and then you click on show hidden files then you click apply and then ok then you go to your C drive you will see this folder and when you when you go into view and say don't show hidden files as you can see here this boot file will disappear that means those are the hidden files so when you say apply it will bring back those hidden files so this folder here that you see runs whenever the computer boots and this is the syswin virus so what we are going to do, I'm going to click Ctrl Alt Delete in order for me to go to the task manager. Then you click task manager. So I'm going to show you that whenever you start your computer, this virus will run. As you can see, you go to startups. It shows this file is enabled. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to disable it. Then after I'm going to go to processes where the files are running. Then you have to scroll down and look for syswin. And you see syswin is running and is taking 25% of the CPU. We are going to stop it by saying end task. And when you say end task, it will be switched off then what i'm going to do here i normally zip it and send it to compress then the next one this virus itself as you can see it has an x it is a uh, an application and if you try to go to its properties it has dot exe it is an application it's not a folder so when you click on it, it mess up your computer. So I want you to click Shift Delete after selecting it. Then click OK. You click Yes. Now your computer is very clean. You don't... So I normally leave this there, but some people were asking me why I'm not, why I'm not seeing the syswin, what, what. In the previous video, I was zipping it. So this one, you can even delete it. Control, uh, Shift, Delete. You don't need it. And if you're not having it in your computer, your computer is safe. It is very safe. You don't need it. And you can even delete the, the boot. You don't need all those. So that means our computer is now okay. And I expect everything to run very smooth. And then when you install new files, based on our previous video, I was installing an FL Studio, everything will work. So I'm going to put the last video that I recorded in the description and also in the card up here below. So thanks for watching. If this video was helpful, please subscribe. In case you're not seeing this syswin in your computer, you're safe. You don't have the virus your computer is very clean so thanks for watching if this video was helpful please give me a thumbs up comment share on all social media 
Thanks, goodbye.